hello viewers welcome to my youtube channel so in today's video we are going to see how to add push notifications to wordpress to wordpress site so as you know that uh, push notifications are a small pop-up message that are displayed at the uh, top of the browser or on a mo mobile browser uh, th that will display some uh, important information like latest post information discount codes and other uh, latest trend in your uh, niche so the this uh, push notifications are useful both to the webmaster and also to the viewers. Let's see how to uh, create a push notification in mobile and web. So for this we will be using a, a service called Push Engage. So Push Engage is a web service that will be used to send push notifications to your web visitors. Both mobile and desktop. So let's see what are the uh, uh, different pr pricing and plans that are available in the Push Engage services. So there are different uh, uh, plans that are under uh, Push Engage service. So you can see the free plan is uh, supported. So you don't have to pay anything. So in the free plan, you can get up to 2500 subscribers. So whenever uh, a visitor subscribes to uh, your Push Engage uh, push notification service, it will be considered as a subscriber. So you can send up to 120 notifications per month. So uh, and, and there are other features uh, the here. You can look at the uh, different features here at this URL. So now if you take a business plan. So this business plan can be built monthly or built yearly. So there are uh, additional features and additional facilities uh, uh, due to this uh, business plan. So in this business plan you can uh, subscribe. Uh, they can have up to uh, 1 lakh subscribers. But initially you will have only 5000 subscribers limit. And uh, for the other thing you have to calculate your price. And one of the advantages uh, in this plan is you can send unlimited notifications per month. And you can uh, add this push engage services on three sites. And there are other uh, features. Now let's see how to add a push notification in WordPress site. Now once you have subscribed to a plan or uh, using the free plan, uh, you log into the push engage uh, page. So you can log into the push engage place. So here you can see the home page. So click on login. So this will take to the push engage service page. Now first of all let, let's see how to install this uh, push engage uh, web service. So for this uh, purpose we can see how to uh, do this uh, task. So go to settings on the uh, push engage dashboard. Under uh, site settings you can see ins uh, installation settings. So here you can see there are different options. So the Push Engage service itself has given uh, uh, dif uh, different ways on how to install your uh, Push Engage uh, code. So if it is if you are using a HTTPS uh, website, then you have to include this Push Engage code. So this push, push Engage script code, this has to be included in the most probably the header or in the HTML of your website. Next, the second thing you have to do is you have to download a package file or a service worker file. This you have to download and you have to copy to the root of your website. So generally you can take the help of your host to uh, uh, include this uh, service worker uh, file. So if you are using a WordPress site, so if you are using WordPress site, there is an uh, easy way you can take help the help of a push engage plugin here. Download the push engage pl plugin here, create uh, generate a API key here and add that API key in the WordPress uh, dashboard. This will uh, this is more easy for WordPress sites. Similarly, you can uh, uh, add this push engage service for different uh, uh, CMS like Magento, Shopify, Protoshop, and others. Uh, one another advantage in the business plan. So I, I'm currently using a business plan of push engage. So in the push engage, uh, in the business plan, you can remove the uh, whatever the advertisement or, or whatever the attribution that is uh, supported by push engage. So you can remove the powered by push engage uh, message by checking the mark here. So this is how you are going to install the push engage service on your WordPress site. Now let's see how to create a notification. Once it is installed and uh, successful, you can create a notification uh, once there are uh, subscribers. It is better that uh, you send a notification when there are enough subscribers like about 250 to 300. So now let's see, you can either create a notifications under notifications, notifications create, so new notification. So here you can create a new notification 
or otherwise you can click the uh, plus symbol here at the top this is also send a new notification so when you click a new notification here so uh, uh, this page will open so this is how you create it and add a new notification add a push new no uh, push uh, new notification in uh, uh, push engage service so this will send to this uh, notification will be push notification will be sent to all the subscribers who are subscribed to your uh, service so for this purpose you have to see here you have to uh, enter a notification title uh, this will uh, say for example uh, how to uh, how to change windows 10 local account password so here you can see that uh, in the, uh, the typical notification uh, will be displayed here you can see the preview of your notification here so uh, this uh, word limit is limited to 85 words so notification below the uh, notification title you can send uh, click this message to see more details so here you can see the uh, typical notification message below the notification title next the important part of this uh, push notification is that you have to uh, enter a notification URL so uh, the main purpose of your uh, push notification is either to get conversions or opt-ins so now uh, once you send a uh, notification URL this can be your, uh, your, your uh, purchase URL or uh, a product URL or a post URL or a, any other kind of uh, website URL uh, or URL that can be entered here so whenever the uh, subscriber receives this uh, notification he will click it and he will go to that particular a page or post or product uh, category now another important thing that we can do here is we can add a notification icon image here so uh, i have typically added my photo here you can add a, a similar icon here there are other features uh, in the uh, create new notification you can do multi action notification here so enable this uh, option so there you can have two buttons here so this will be displayed see here on the right side you can see the preview so in windows 10 chrome a typical notification will look like this in windows 7 chrome it will look like this in windows 10 firefox it will look like this in mac os chrome it will look like this in android chrome it will uh, look uh, typical like this so in different browsers in windows 10 windows 7 and android and mac os you can send these push notifications so now you can add the two buttons also here so you can add the button label button url and button image here so all these things ca can be added under multi action notification and the option is notification large image so now you can uh, add an image to your push notification so once you click on uh, enable this notification large image you can click on insert image so here you have see i have uh, inserted some uh, images here uh, you can upload this uh, images uh, so uh, when you click on the upload here you can click to upload any image if you don't want to upload image and directly copy from the web addresses then you can uh, enter the uh, file URL from the web so enter the URL of the web here so this will automatically uh, the image will be added here so this is how you add a uh, notification large image in push engage so now you can uh, another option here is uh, notification duration how, uh, how long you can uh, want to keep your notification that is if you uh, 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 sometimes the subscribers will not immediately click on the uh, push notification that you have sent it will take some set time so for this you can set an expiration limit next you can add UTM parameters that is if you want to uh, 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 track your uh, push notifications and uh, uh, find the analytics of a push notification from uh, which sources uh, this being clicked you can add this uh, uh, UTM parameters so you can add UTM source, UTM medium, UTM campaign, UTM turn, UTM content like that next uh, the another option is in the business plan you have and uh, higher plans you have you can uh, send the notification you send the push notification immediately or you can take some time and another important uh, thing uh, in the create uh, in an uh, create and uh, adding a push notification in wordpress site is selecting the audience so here you can uh, select the audience based upon date range this is one of the important facilities so between the uh, particular dates how many uh, subscribers that have subscribed to your push notification uh, will be uh, selected and another thing is the segmentation you can uh, add the segments here this we will talk about in a later video another important feature here you can uh, uh, send the push notification based upon a country 
so if you want to send the your push notification only to audience in united states or canada or australia you can include this country for example as see you when you click here india united states like all the countries will be displayed here so now you can select the particular countries to send the push notification only to those countries you can exclude the countries also and if you are so very particular then you can include the state and include the city then uh, you can uh, include the device type so next you can see you can send the push notifications to desktop or mobile or to both or browser you can see there are different kinds of browser that you can send so the push notifications will be sent only to that particular browsers so this is how we uh, add a push notification uh, to wordpress site using the above service uh, thank you for watching my video please subscribe to my channel